A woman and three children are in the hospital tonight after a fire on the city's northwest side. And sources tell WGN News a Chicago firefighter lives in the home and was on duty when the fire started. Our Shannon Halligan is live from the Mount Clare neighborhood with the latest. Shannon. Yeah, friends of the family dropped off flowers at the door of the burned out home and neighbors tonight are still waiting to hear how everyone is doing after they were rushed to the hospital listed in critical condition. I just heard sirens everywhere. Neighbors in the Montclair neighborhood rushed out Tuesday night to see firefighters working to put out a house fire in the 2500 block of North Rutherford Avenue. I heard there were children and they were trying to resuscitate them. Officials say a 34-year-old woman, 2-year-old girl, 7-year-old girl, and 7-year-old boy were pulled from the home. They were rushed to area hospitals in critical condition. Neighbors like Joel Rivera were shocked by the news. I was actually kind of surprised at the outcome because it didn't seem like like it was a, an enormous fire. Uh, if you look outside their home, it, there's no damage really to the outside. It's all in the inside. So I was actually shocked to see the amount, it, the amount of damage it did to the individuals inside. Smoke detectors could be heard going off from inside the home. Still, Alderman Gilbert Villegas handed out smoke detectors to ensure neighbors weren't left unprepared. It's sad. It's sad because, uh, especially when you see the children. Well, the police tape has been removed from outside of the home, and investigators are still working to determine what caused the fire. Live in the Montclair neighborhood, Shannon Halligan, WGN News.